Hello everyone and welcome back to Lawrence Plays GTA Manhunt Checkpoint. Um, I've accidentally found myself rather closer to this checkpoint than I meant to, so I'm just going to grab that and then carry on going. Um, oh, and run this red light because that's Mike right behind me. I put my foot down because he doesn't seem to have noticed me. Um, he will have done now though. So, um, yeah, I was actually planning to take a slightly more... Um, unusual and un hopefully unexpected route up to that checkpoint but it turned out that I miscounted my bridges and <laughs> ended up going straight for it so um, yeah sorry I was um, I would normally give you a little bit more of an, um, an intro than that uh, so yeah welcome anyway to uh, manhunt checkpoint the um, in this game mode we um, I drive around the city trying to pick up the checkpoints and the hunters drive around the city trying to spot me and if they spot me they'll um, generally be very very violent towards me and um, Try and try and stop me from collecting any any more. Of that what? No, that wasn't the car I wanted you to get into. Um, and generally try and stop me from getting getting them all. So it's been it hasn't been going brilliantly so far today. So I was there was a, going through that one quite so smoothly was a little bit of a surprise. That's, that's that car I want. It's gone down there. Um, <laughs> why am I fixating on a specific car when there's loads of them? Oh. And I think the reason it's not going brilliantly for me is because, to be honest, I'm not driving very well today. I'm not quite sure why not, but... Oh, I seem to be struggling. I'm even having difficulty getting this car from this AI, so I am probably doomed. But I'm going to keep trying anyway, because it's, it's good fun, and at the very worst, in the worst case, I'll make a clip show or something out of this and uh, make an episode of just me repeatedly get, having chases and getting caught. So... I am going in completely the wrong direction. I don't know why I'm still driving up this road, in fact. Let's turn round. There we go. Oh, there's a scuff mark on the front of the car from where I hit that, from where I, dro uh, where I drove into it in the Mini. Um, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Let's put the roof up. The roof up has, helps, helps hide me from view a little bit, I think. Um, okay. So that was a concern. That was definitely Pete. Um, I think he was suspicious by the way he changed direction. He, he braked rather suddenly. Um, so he's probably been using the distance indicator to work out where he is compared to me. I don't know what he's doing up in the hills up here, actually. I don't know how, the, how they've worked out I'm up here. Um, because I thought I was basically away from... Um, it was Mike who was following me initially, I think. So I'm surprised he's that close, sort of with me to that extent. Um, but that does make me sort of feel I want to change this car again now, because he's definitely seen it. So it's definitely kind of burned. I reckon I'm probably safe and free and away from him. Um, but I'm going to try and put some distance down, and then duck down a side road, and then maybe even an alleyway. So like this. Oop. Oh. Yeah, you see, this is what I meant about just driving really, really badly today. Um, I'm not sure what's wrong with me. It just doesn't seem to be going well. I'm going to ghost this car and then see if I can nick it at the next track. No, I'm not, because I've driven into it like a Muppet. You see, I'm getting outwitted by the AI. This is not good. <laughs> okay, another Sentinel. That'll, that'll have to do. Right, I'm going to try and behave a little bit for a minute or two now. I'm just trying to keep an eye out for any more of those hunter cars. Currently in third place. That's not... Oh, there we go. Fourth place. That means I'm now legitimately allowed to take the next checkpoint, should I feel the urge to. So the next checkpoint is um, all the way down in Ghetto. I got about as far as this one last time. And then I got um, spotted on the way into Ghetto and then chased all over the, uh, all over the city and eventually caught, caught when I managed to prang the car up against a sort of a... Um, a place where the road splits to go in two different directions. So I'm going to try not to do that this time. See if we can do a bit better. Um, now, what's the best way to approach the ghetto checkpoint? There's, it's on a crossroads. So there's four different, four obvious different ways you can approach it from. Um, but they're all sort of fairly major roads, and again, and there's a good chance they'll have hunters drifting up and down them because, well, of course they're going to look up and down them because they're, they're trying to find me. So maybe I ideally want to try and sneak in through a more obscure route so perhaps down one of the alleyways but I've done that fairly recently and so I think they're going to be expecting it especially as earlier today for, for a different check, checkpoint checkpoint number two I um, ended up taking that checkpoint twice by nipping down an alleyway and 
shooting across and the second time they, they spotted me coming out of it they've worked out where they've worked out that i liked that route that route in which is why i didn't do that this time and i went up across well <laughs> i intended to go across the, the the next bridge along and then loop brown but i accidentally went across the bridge directly towards it but you know never mind it works i'm not knocking it what is that mini doing that is the second time that mini has driven up and driven into me if if i didn't know better i would think that was a hunter just being difficult and having changed cars but they're not allowed to change cars so it, it really shouldn't be one of them <laughs> oh right so let's see so that yeah the ghetto checkpoint there's as i say it's on a crossroads there's four obvious ways to approach it but then there are other smaller roads that lead up to the the roads that go into that crossroads so coming along one of those and then racing through is probably going to be the best way to do it i think they know that I like to try and be subtle and not not approach. Oop, that was rather poor, poor paying attention. And not to approach them from along the main roads in the most obvious directions. What is going on with traffic in this game today? <laughs> There's that mini that has been kept driving into me. That van that just drove round. I mean, okay, he wants you want to do the right turn on a red thing, which is fair enough. Except I'm pretty sure you're not allowed to do that when there's another car in front of you. There's another one. I'm getting away from this junction before something stupid happens. And I'm pretty sure that isn't a right turn only lane or anything like that. So, oh, I don't know what the AI is thinking. So, let's see. I've done this bef this sort of had this thought before. If I just head all the way down along through along through downtown all the way over to the eastern edge of it and then head down from there, I can get down into ghetto at the other end of it and be slightly less obvious. Last time I tried to do it, I was a, I was an extra road further down, the one that's right next to the highway. Um, and it turns out that turns into a one-way street partway along. So that was less less than ideal. But this time I think I'm doing slightly better. I'm um, I'm up by top end of square of squares. So if I go across here, um, up two blocks and then turn right, left, right, that should get me down into the onto a um, onto the road that heads down next to the storm drain. There's a purple car. That's a worry. Ooh, ah, I pressed the wrong stick. <laughs> oh, no wonder I'm getting into myself in trouble today. Oh, he didn't see me do it, though. That's a good sign. So he's heading off there at high speed. While he's doing that, I'm going to change my mind about what I was saying before. I'm going to turn right on that red. There's a green here, so I can go left here. Follow this road to the end. I'm going to run this red light because I'm in a hurry. I'm slightly concerned. And I'm going to turn right here, which you can do legally on a red. So even someone's watching, they might not notice. I can try and keep an eye out behind me as well. That's something I need to do. <laughs> okay, now I'm starting to get into the sort of the, the danger area. Now, there's a, a few things in now. So I'm getting closer. Um, Tristan, the purple car, has probably come back across that bridge by now. He's realised he's gone too far away. So he's going to come back and be looking. For, they're going to be looking for me in this sort of general area. But I'm still a reasonable distance away from the checkpoint. So if I carry on along here, I'm going to... Oh, I went green. Just the right time. That's convenient. Um, I think I want to go a little bit further and then turn right. So let's see... Um, I have a slight concern that you don't see many sentinels in the ghetto, so that might ring some alarm bells. Or alternatively, they might not be um, sufficiently thinking about car types in that sort of way. So I reckon if I come along here and hang a left at this junction, just in time before the red lights went red, somewhere along here, let's take this be in the correct lane for this. Where exactly am I? And <laughs> where is the checkpoint? It's somewhere around here. It's on the it's on the junction between the where the two rail, railways cross. So if I head down here until I find the railway, then that should get take me to it. I'm just gonna carry on running red lights here because I'm close. They know that I'm close. There's Mike. I might just have to follow him. <laughs> and that's never a good plan. Or maybe while that bike's giving him some abuse, I can head over here. Yeah, I am now actually following Mike directly towards the checkpoint, which is extremely unwise. So I'm just going to put my foot down. There's Pete as well. 
They're not going to be expecting me to do that because that is not the way I normally try and do these things. So I think that's probably going to have got me a little bit of distance. Now let's not waste that distance. Let's try and hide from them before they come flying in and spot me. Because I think I, think I had some distance over them then because I was going faster than they were. I'm back on those main roads again. That's not ideal. In fact, I think I might be Tristan over there. Um, so I'm just going to get out of here. I'm going to pedal to the metal and just just flee. I see cars behind me going, yeah, that's okay. They've, they, they're on me. Oh, I've kind of wasted the, uh, the lead I had. Oh, don't roll, don't roll. I guess that'll do. This is a mess. <laughs> but they've all come down then. Oh no, this is a car park. This is not good. Is there another way out of this car park? I hope so. Otherwise I'm in a lot of trouble. Let's go through here. Yeah, there we go. I can go up this, this ramp. And this brings me out by the by the arena. Yeah, okay. That's good. I, I kind of know where I am now. Um, the big question is, do they know where I am? And if they do, well, they're still obviously still going to be chasing me if they do. Um, I can now loop around back into Ghetto, head up some of the smaller roads, and hopefully that'll... Now they're either, at this point, because I've gone down here, they're either right behind me, or I've lost them. Um, I think I have lost them. I'm just having issues with the camera, there we go. I'm going to hide in here for a little, little while, I think, because this... They're probably unlikely to go along this road. Unless they've seen me go up here, of course. I want to change car. But there have been a number of times recently when I've been spotted and caught changing cars. So I don't really want to do it until I'm convinced I'm safe. Now, let's see, I'm in first place. which is for The next checkpoint is up by the casino. Yeah, I'm going to change cars because this one is well and truly burned. I'll just change into this one for now. And I'll try and get another good one on the way up. Okay, there we go. That's a green light. <laughs> okay, I couldn't quite take it sensibly because there was a, a stolen, a, an abandoned car in the middle of the road. I can't imagine why that was there. But, you know. Okay, so now <laughs> I can sort of start to think, think calmly again now because I've um, hopefully escaped. So now, let's see, I need to wait until I'm in fourth place in order to take the next checkpoint. <clears throat> because that's that's the rule. Sort of splash orange, I got scared. Um, there goes purple. Uh, because, the, yeah, the rule is that I have to wait until I'm in last place before I take the next checkpoint in order to give give them a bit of a chance to regroup and get ready on the um, around the next checkpoint. To, to, so so that essentially I'm not they're not racing me up there and with me just trying to flee as fast as I possibly can. Um, now I know that okay they're now all ahead of me so I, I can legit oop, I can go I can legitimately take the next checkpoint but I do need to get up there so this is the one that's up by the casino um, the last couple of times we've done this map I've looped round to the north and circled down to get it from there and that's a reasonably good way to get it 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 um, it, it works. It's, it's, it's not too obvious, so it tends to throw them off a little bit. Um, it's not the most obvious way to get to get to it, so I quite like doing it that way. But I have done it twice in a row, so I'm not going to do that again. <laughs> um, <clears throat> other options? Well, I could I could approach it from the um, from uh, just straight along the main road that comes from to go, run straight through the middle of Vinewood. That's quite good because actually there's no reason that's good. It's it's a really obvious one. The hunters can absolutely peg it up and down, so they can go really fast along there and keep a, and cover the whole area and keep a really good guard over it. Um, and there's loads of traffic lights, so I can't go along it at high speed without risking being really really obvious because I'm running loads of red lights. So that's that's definitely out. I definitely don't want to take it from that direction. Um, I could go up through Mirror Park. That's certainly a possibility that's quite a nice way of, of getting to the uh, getting up to it and that sort of seems to be what I'm doing at the moment I'm currently drifting over to, in the sort of towards towards mirror park but but I know that Tristan in particular likes to sort of patrol the mirror park area so I'm not sure about that that leaves the um, from the south then as being the 
the other other cardinal direction essentially you can see it's on a crossroad you can approach it from the north south east or west and i think the south way is probably going to be quite a good one it's not quite it's not i'm not going to be on the freeway so i'm not going to be going quite as fast as i might be up there but i think it's probably going to be the the best way to do it so if i head up if I turn left here, that'll get me across back into downtown. And then I can then sort of rattle over a little bit towards Square of Squares. And then head up. Oh, this is an oracle. That's why it's quite good. Um, and then I can, I can go over to head, head Square of Squares, just past the, the far side of it, and then head up from there. Yes, yeah, so I think that's probably my best bet. So let's give that a shot. I'll carry on following this emperor. Is it an emperor? I don't know. I think it might be. Um, it's not a great car, whatever it is. It doesn't really matter. I'm not in it. <laughs> uh, so yes, if I if I head over to the other side of Square Squares up, and then just head up north from there, and then after I've crossed the under the uh, over the freeway, sorry, then go right and follow up that sort of wiggly road and come in from the south. The other advantage of that is there's a bit of a sort of a there's a kind of hill heading up up there, so it's it's, it's uphill to the checkpoint, and I think there's a decent chance that that might hide me from them as I approach it. So I think it's quite worth try, uh, right turn on red. There we go. I saw that purple car too. I'm worried. Oh, oh no, they're doing the. Oh, I've moved. I better, better go. Um, yeah, okay. So, so purple didn't spot me there, which is um, a relief. So let's see. I was saying up to up to square square. They're now the other side of it. So I want to get, head over to the the uh, northwest corner and go from there. So that purple car has disappeared now hmm. I sort of it sort of makes me want to do a run for the checkpoint because if he's behind me then he's not guarding it quite so much um, but on the, was that him again yes it was blimey he got around in front of me quickly he's going okay he's going across he's not coming up here I'm I'm, I'm, I'm going <laughs> I'm not I'm not obeying that red light Maybe the next one, though. What's going on here? Why are you stopping? There are no traffic lights. Why are you stopping? <laughs> Thanks. Okay, I'll stop at this one. And I shall watch behind me and get extremely paranoid. So here we go. This is the wiggly bit I was talking about going up to the top. So as I, f I follow this round to, the, uh, round to the right. And then this winds sort of round back and forth a couple of times so it's a bit curvy which gives me lots of time to sort of take a corner in a dodgy way and get spotted because of it there's a green light that's nice and then as I go up this hill follow it round to the right and then there'll be a checkpoint basically at the top of it I'm in first place I'm gonna skip this light as well I I mean if I'm in first I might as well go for it because it means I am the clip closest or somebody else is similarly close okay let's follow that white car especially as he's driving a little bit funnily I'm going this way bye <laughs> okay so I don't think Mike saw me there so I am going to now put my foot down now I was what was that goodness sake AIs I mean not only was that an abrupt and probably illegal lane change it was a sort of a wild lag twitch across the road. Maybe my, my, my um, internet connection isn't running quite as nicely as it should be. Okay, so here we go. I was saying earlier, I know that Tristan likes to um, patrol Mirror Park, but or the Mirror Park, the road up to Mirror Park, but I knew he wasn't there because I'd seen him down by Square Squares, so I reckon that was safe. Uh, give me a Mini. I, like, I quite like Minis. They're small and agile and reasonably quick, and I haven't had much of a chance to drive them too often. So I'm going to take this. <laughs> Do you see that? That's a, that's an amazing J turn. Um, entirely down to the car rather than me, I have to say, because it wasn't a, it wasn't a brilliantly done one from my point of view, but the car handled it perfectly. Okay, so now I have to get myself away from here and down to the next checkpoint, <clears throat> and that's over in um, over by the golf course. Would well, be just beyond the golf course, in fact. So there are again, there's multiple ways to approach it. Um, you can. Ooh, here's an idea. I'm going in the wrong way for this, but yeah. What if... What if I try and approach it from the north? Because that's a weird direction to approach that from, because you can't get there very easily. 
Although, actually, from here, you sort of can... From this direction, you sort of can. Hmm. All right, let's 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 try this, because it's a little bit different. What I'm going to do, and I'm going to do this at speed, because I don't... Ex I don't expect there to be any of them up there guarding this 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 area. What I'm going to do is I'm going to head back up to this checkpoint, and then up into the hills a bit, and try and go through that way, and take the check and get round to the checkpoint. Um, there's an abandoned purple car there. That's interesting. Um, I could take that. That'd be quite fine, kind of funny. But no, that I mean, as soon as they saw a purple car, well, they 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 they'd, they'd be pretty sure it was me. I think. But it is it was very, very tempting. And I don't think there are rules against it. Um it's no, it's not it's not a sports or a supercar. It's one that's been found on the road. So yeah, I think I could perfectly legitimately take that. But I'm not going to because it would be really, really obvious, that's the whole point. The hope would be that the um the hunters would see it and think I was I was Tristan. But then there's always always a reasonable chance that Tristan would see it and know I wasn't him. And if I'm being really paranoid, I have to admit there is a chance that it was left there deliberately and they were hoping that I would take it and then be really really obvious because I was making jokes about heading back to the uh, starting point and and uh, picking up and, and looking to see if they'd left any abandoned cars there so they might have been trying to um, you know double bluff triple bluff I don't know how many bluffs that would be but trying to tempt trying to tempt me into taking it okay so if I no, not this soon now this isn't ideal because I'm heading along the big obvious road between the two checkpoints um, so I wouldn't be surprised if I saw a hunter going along here. Last time I was playing this 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 map, um, I was going along here in the opposite direction, and Pete was definitely patrolling this road. So it's possible I'll see him. Uh, but if I do, I can always bail off the road at the next junction because there's I'm far enough away at the moment that you won't immediately get suspicious of a specific car if his position changes. But you will get suspicious and start driving up and down that area, trying to get a feel for the distance. Okay, so I'm coming up to Eclipse Towers now. This is about the point where I want to um, leave this road. So if I, essentially, if I carry on straight a bit, a bit ahead, where the road curves round to the left, I'm in a right turn only lane. Eh, I don't want to go up there. Let's check the radios off. There we go. I don't want to start dancing in my seat. That's never a good plan. Yeah, because I'm in the wrong wrong lane, I'm just going to go for it and do that. And this is how I always end up with a damaged car, isn't it? I just I do stupid things like that and end up with a prang on the front of it. I'm I'm not going to change this for now. We'll see how I feel in a bit. Um, and actually, as I go through the hills here, I might see something better that I want to take. Okay, so. Where am I? <laughs> this is the tricky part of this. Okay, if I turn turn right, uh, right, I'm not very good at left and right apparently. If I turn left here and just follow this one along, this should be the sort of the little fiddly roads that go that wend their way through the lower hills. And if I follow this one all the way to the end, I think it might drop me out onto that main road, which I can then just blast down all the way to the checkpoint. I mean, I'm not going to blast down it, actually. I did that before, and I, I, I found a phoenix, and, you know, if you have a phoenix, you kind of have to go fast. It's what they're there for. Because um, they're, they're, they're the sort of the... the I think they're, the, they're, they're probably the fastest of all the muscle cars, so it seemed rude not to. But since I'm in an Issy, uh, the, the Mini, I'm just going to drive a little bit more sensibly, because I can't can't pull off quite so much speed. So this is the top end of the university, I think. Yeah, well, this is the university. If I am where I think I am, then this will bring me out onto the road I wanted to. Um, we'll see when I when, when, we, when I when I have the map for the for the playback. We'll uh, we'll see where I am at the moment, and I'll I'll know whether I've got it right, and I'll be able to tell there where I've got it right or not. And yes, I have. This is this is the road. I recognise it well. So we'll just pull out onto here. And again, this is. Trying to there's the checkpoint. So this is the old trying to approach the checkpoint from an odd direction. With any luck, I'll be able to just turn right at the checkpoint. Oh, I'm trying to see where the um where the actual checkpointy things are. Yeah, I can just go through here and do the old right on a red. So you stop the car, look around, then go, and then get rammed in the side by a. I was driving perfectly. How dare you? How very dare you? I, I want your insurance details. Ooh, that was a big one. 
Yep, yeah, okay. <laughs> I think I'm going to say they've probably found me at this point. Um, and uh, yeah, we're gonna have to, I'm going to have to start running again. Now, a bright red Mini is possibly not the ideal getaway vehicle. Although, I mean, in the Italian job it worked, but they had a, they had a white one and a blue one as well to, sort of, to confuse people. That sounded like Pete getting out of his car. Uh, that's good, because that means they're down to two hunters. Oh no, it wasn't Pete. Maybe it was, maybe it was Mike getting out of his car then. <laughs> Pete has not been um, has not suffered from the end or braking manoeuvre from me quite so many times as Tristan has, so he's not quite so um, aware that if you're chasing someone, you need to be right behind them because if they stamp on the brakes, you're gonna lose them. I thought that was Mike for a minute. I was going, how on earth has he got there? But no, it's fine. It was not him. Oh, that was a big slide. Damn front wheel drive cars. I mean, it can do that. Ooh, that was a lot of blinking from Mike then. Interesting, I'm sure I heard a car door again, and I was expecting to get some bullets behind me as I did that um, bit of fleeing, but but no, apparently not. Oh! <laughs> it's poor Mini. Oh, and I'm dead again. <laughs> oh, well. That was a better run than the earlier one, so yeah. Thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this episode, and I'll uh, see you in the next one. Uh, it's been sus. Three and a half he's blocks. Entered, he's, entered first, he's entered first. And given okay. that I've just gone through the checkpoint, he yeah, is in a north. mini heading north. Um, yeah, what, sorry? Mini, he's in a great mini heading north. He has just taken, taken the checkpoint. And he has got a lot of pace on me. Right. Oh, yeah, I see. Turn left uh, here. I turned left early. Uh, I can't see him. I've lost eyes. Uh, I didn't see him come out this way. No, because he's gone that way. The other side of golf course, not seen him yet. <laughs> yes, I, I say I am literally in the hills, uh, in Vinewood Hills, so very north. I think we have lost him, but I'm going to head east to head in towards the next one from that side. I'm going to head Just hit west. fourth now, actually. Whereabouts? Uh, it's still in Vinewood Hills. Okay. However, he has gone forth, so he Kind of is... north of Eclipse Tower, or like northwest of Eclipse Tower, I should say. Okay. He is heading back in slowly now. Very slowly. Yeah. I think he's All going heading round. along the road which is just to the north side of the highway that runs through the middle. I can never remember if it's the Olympic um, freeway or the... Del Perro. Oh, Del Perro. So I can never I think remember. think Del Perro is east-west. Olympic freeway is north-south, I think. I know, both, both of them are east-west. It's just... Oh. There it's are two east-west east highways. Yeah. One through the middle of the I'm city currently one. fourth and not providing information for a moment. I'm heading out east. Um, I've just seen a car heading at speed down train track. Uh, that might have been me. Yeah. Okay. Right, just I've just gone first, so he hasn't taken the checkpoint yet. So I'm still I'm about four. to block out the checkpoint. One second. Just gone third second. Back out at fourth. Mm. Still first. Still that was second. janky as hell. What are you? I'm getting close no. at fourth. It wasn't that, this woman. Okay. Still first. That one there, Bam. that one there. It's just gone through a red light. Yep, this one here. Um, heading along south. Yep, about got it. Checkpoint. Heading towards uh, oilfield. Yeah, that direction, Tristan. Yeah. I've had an accident. Oh, right. right I thought end. I saw Pete. I saw him. Right at the end. Thank you. I thought he was right here, yeah. Probably not Elysian Island. Probably following this round to the right. I think I saw moving out there. Yeah, yeah got him. Uh, straight on so far. 
I have the bridge. Um, I think we straight past Maze Bank. Arena. Uh, yep, yeah, sorry, yes. Yeah, so he's taking the jump. Ow, Thank I hit a tree. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, did he continue forwards? Or? I assume he did. I don't know, I hit a tree. Okay. Uh, no eyes. But then again, there's a few different ways he could have gone. gone first so he's now within the block of the checkpoint and we're taking first I'm flipping first thing with him I can see the checkpoint he's still in first I've taken the checkpoint and just gone first I believe that he's taking he it yes I'll take it I'll just take him gone first that car even though it's a little bit sus uh, golf course the next one I've just gone second. Bagel's in first. Just bombing for the checkpoint. Yeah. Because I'm really very close. Okay. I think he's taken it. I'm really close. This Sorry. red mini here. This red mini here. He's in this red mini here. That one. Um, I think so, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's very like definitely not behaving in AI like, isn't it? Are you also on my teleporting directions? Uh, uh, I see you. Um, I see Tristan. Go by Life Invader if that helps. Thank you. South side of Life Invader. Oh, this is not running happily. Like this happened. Yeah. Uh, right. Heading left in front of the big cathedral. But Passy. Uh, Oh. oh, sorry. You did some crazy blinking there. Good heavens. Yeah, I may or may not be suffering from lag. Not gonna lie. I think my wife is watching me in Chelsea. Why is that affecting me as well, though? Hey, ah, just flipped well. him. So is your wife, wife watching me in Chelsea? Where no. are you guys? Can you? Dying. Yes. Okay. I think I've had every kill so far. Makes no. a change. 